Wisconsin State Fair, of course, was supposed to be in full swing right now. So we thought we'd do something to help you get your fix. Today, our chef created a breakfast combo that's stacked with some delicious fair favorites. As Molly mentioned earlier, Chef Kate Luloff is here with Jones Dairy Farm, and she created a breakfast sandwich that includes, is this right, funnel cake, sausage, and even cheese curds, Kate? Whoa. It's fair food. Everybody's <laughs> missing, everybody's missing the fair, right? So it's not gonna be particularly healthy today, but it's gonna be so tasty. And everybody has to get their fair food, you know, once or twice a year. So if we can't go and get it, we're gonna make it at home. Absolutely. So where do we start with this? I don't even know where so, you would begin. Yep, so I'm gonna jump in right away with the funnel cakes because I'm actually gonna um, fry those while we're talking. So it's easy, four wet ingredients, four dry ingredients. I've got a little bit of milk. Um, to that, we're gonna add one egg. And then we've got just a little bit of water and a little bit of vanilla. Okay. You're going to whisk those up. And I've got my oil over here heating to about 350 to 375. Um, you can use a candy thermometer. If you don't have any kind of thermometer, one quick tip is just to take the back end of a wooden spoon and place it in the oil. And if it gets all the little bubbles around the, the end of the spoon, you know that the oil's hot, ready to go. Oh, great. Oh, tip. that's cool. You don't have to take the temp then. No, if, if it's bubbling, we're good to go. So those are the wet ingredients. And then to that, we're going to add a little bit of sugar, a little pinch of salt, a little baking powder, which is what's going to help that fluff up and rise. And then about a half a cup of, of just all purpose flour. Okay. And you're going to whisk that up until it's real nice and smooth. You want to make sure that all the lumps are out because when you're pouring it, you don't want to have any lumps. So that's what you're going to mix up for the batter. I just put mine in, uh, in a zip top egg and then snip the end off. If you have a squeeze bottle, that works too. Our oil is hot and funnel cakes are so fun. So totally random, perfect imperfection. <laughs> okay. So just, we're just going to squeeze some of this into here and you just kind of, kind of do it around in a little circle here and you'll form your little, your little funnel cake, which is going to be our bun. Oh yeah. Look at bubbling. Yeah. Oh, so oh yeah. This is going to be, the, be bun the bun is the funnel cake. Yep, the bun's the funnel cake. So this will be your top and your bottom. Cool. And this this recipe for this batter will make um, enough for four sandwiches. So you'll get eight eight uh, little funnel cakes out of this. Great. So, oh, that's going to be delicious. These, and these fry really quickly. So we're just going to let those in there. We're going to let them fry up a little bit. And then, of course, the other deep fried goodness to this recipe, we've got some cheese curds. Mm -hmm. You can just buy the frozen breaded <laughs> cheese curds. Drop those in there. I hear you laughing. <laughs> well, here's the Drop. deal. Here's what I'm thinking as you're doing this is I'm thinking yeah. we promised that we were going to help you get your state fair fix. We did not say anything about your health or that we're going to give That's you right. a um, <laughs> a diet friendly <laughs> sandwich. That's right. And you know what? We do a lot of we do a lot of healthy recipes. It's okay to do one that's not so healthy once in a while. So. Okay, so this is gonna fry. And then previously to this, I just cooked up, we are putting on here a sausage patty, uh, a pork sausage patty, which is this red one here. And then we're also doing a chicken sausage patty. So you're gonna get your chicken and your pork and your egg and your cheese curds and then the funnel cakes. And we're gonna top it with a little raspberry jam just for a little extra sweet. So I had warmed those previously. Are those um, in the freezer section too, Kate? Or and are those chicken. more in the yes. deli? Nope, you will find all of our sausage products because they are all natural certified gluten-free and never any nitrates or nitrites and no additives or preservatives. So those are always in the freezer section. Um, and you will find them, like I said, we have chicken, we have the mild, there's a purple box, that's maple flavor. There's I love a green that box, that's turkey. So we've got all different flavors, whatever it is you're looking for, whatever your tastes are, you'll find it. But yes, always look in the freezer section for those. Okay. So, so and then if you need to know, you're flipping those. Yep, I'm flipping them over. It was just like maybe a minute. They get golden brown, we're gonna flip them. Stir those cheese oh, curds yeah. around a little bit. <laughs> oh, Sweating yeah. and in some meat. oil. I can't even right. imagine how good your kitchen smells right now. I was now. just going to say, I wish you could smell my kitchen. It smells oh. like we're at the fair. <laughs> so good. I'm just debating, so do I want like, do I want jam? Do I want ketchup with this too or syrup? Like what? Uh, you know what? Any of those probably would work. I didn't try it with ketchup. I did try it with syrup. It was delicious. Um, but the jam is my favorite. Just that little bit of extra berry kick with the sweets. And then after I warmed the sausages, then I just did some fried eggs. You do them however you want. If you like the yolks done, um, go ahead and do that all the way cooked. Otherwise, I like a good runny egg. And Me again, too. this is not meant to be a nice little dainty meal. This is going to be messy. <laughs> so make sure you grab your napkin when you're eating this, right? And if you do the runny egg, you're going to bite in. It's going to just, you know, just gush be all over, everywhere. which is awesome. Like really Yum. like think you're at the fair. So, um, yeah, so these are just going to finish frying real quick and... The sausages, again, like you said, in the freezer section, if you need to know where to find them, 
we do have a product locator on our website, which is jonesdairyfarm.com. That's right. And that's so simple. You just put in where you're located uh, or you put in the product and the location. It tells you all the products that are near you and where they're located, right? So you can that's find exactly right. your that's favorite exactly stuff. That's exactly right. Easy to use. Yeah, you put in your zip code. You can see that, that map there. You put in your zip code and then the, you can search for all the products you're looking for at the stores closest to you, which makes it super convenient because there's certain things that we love. Like I'm with Tiff, I love the, the, the maple sausage. And yes. when it comes to bacon, I love the cherry wood smoke. Mm -hmm. Me too. And then you can find exactly what stores will carry those for you. Okay, so we've got, so we've got our funnel cake, our sausage, our fried egg, and then I think I'll do the jam now because that'll kind of hold the, uh, the cheese curds in place. Mm. Okay, so we're going to take our cheese curds out. You can see they're starting to, to ooze all over the place, which is good. You want to grab them right before they start to, to, right before the cheese starts to come out. What do you put okay, in? Two again, on like, there? I put two because they're big, yeah. Okay. If they're smaller, you know, you can do a couple, <laughs> couple more. Okay, and then chicken patty on top of that, and then oh. we are going to top it, top it with our other funnel cake. And then, of course, funnel cakes. What do we come? Funnel cakes come with powdered sugar, right? So we're gonna top it with powdered sugar. Kate, will you take a bite? We're out of time. I just want to. I, I want to eat it through your mouth. Like I just want to experience it through oh. you. Here's oh, what that it's gonna look so... like. I'll hold it here so everybody can see. Oh, oh but yeah, my gosh. Super, super delicious. You get the little bit of sweet. You get the the wonderful, you know, the savory from the sausage. You get the egg. So, yes, I promise when I come back to the studio, I will make these for you guys since we missed the fair. So. All right. I'm holding <laughs> you to that. Otherwise, I'm driving through and just picking it up on your doorstep today. Here's I will one. make you one, I promise. <laughs> Thanks, Kate. Thank you. Here's the information for Jones, their funnel cake breakfast sausage sandwich. you got to make this. Dairy, da uh, JonesDairyFarm.com is the product locator and the recipes as well for this delicious fair morning mm, food. Mm, mm, oh, I'm mm. jealous. So jealous. <laughs>